what made me um, look for vasoliposuction? Um, I'm generally a fit and active person, but I'm struggling at the moment to lose fat in certain areas. So phaser seemed to be the only procedure um, that I could have under local, which meant I was awake. Um, recovery time was really quick. So um, that's why I chose it. What made me decide on the surgeon was her reputation. Um, the years of experience she's had in the field. I mean, she originally did liposuction and um, now she's doing vasolipo. So um, it's an experience really. And um, when I met her, I was absolutely amazed at the amount of knowledge she, she had. Um, and I was really comfortable with her. That was the most important thing. So that's the reason why I chose a surgeon. What I expected from the consultation was all my questions to be answered um, about recovery, the actual procedure, what happens on the day, the aftercare, um, when I can go back to doing activity, because I'm a really active person. Um, so all those questions were answered. My expectation of the procedure is more contouring, because I'm already in shape. I just need a bit of contouring just to give me that desired look. Um, Phaser will help me get rid of the excess fat just to give me that shape, <laughs> the hourglass figure that I need. So um, that's, what, uh, that's what made me decide. Manchester Private Hospital. Um, the staff were friendly. Um, the price was not a factor. As soon as I walked through the door, the facility was amazing. I'd made my mind up there and then as soon as I walked through the door. Um, they've got state-of-the-art um, facilities. Um, I, was, I was just comfortable. So. Regardless of what anyone was going to say to me on that day, I'd made my mind up. The day of the surgery was nerve-wracking. I got there first thing in the morning. Um, the surgeon and the staff were all there to greet me, um, take me through to the operating room. Um, I was so nervous. But once I was on the operating table, everything was fine because you're awake throughout the whole procedure. You're speaking to the consultant. Um, you're speaking to the staff. Again, my coordinator was there. So it was amazing. So somebody I knew was in the room. Um, you can hear the machines going. You can see everything happening around you. Um, when they start the actual vasa, you can hear the machine going. You can see the fat going into the canisters. And you're laying there and you're thinking, God, is that for me? <laughs> it's, it's an unbelievable experience. You know, you look at that and you're thinking, those are all the chips I've had all the years, all the crisps, all the junk I've had. And you just look and you say, right, that's it. I'm going to eat healthy from now on. But it's an amazing experience. I mean, from start to finish, you're not there long. You literally walk off the operating table into recovery and you can go home within a few hours. I'd recommend the Manchester Private Hospital. They've got state-of-the-art facilities. You get your own recovery room. I mean, you're not there long anyway after you've had VASA, but the hospital is well-staffed and they offer a personal one-to-one -on -one care. So you don't feel like you want to convey a belt where you've just got to come in and they're quickly rushing you out. It's not like that. I'd just like to say that VASA is just the beginning. Once you have the procedure done, you'll make wiser choices. Um, you'll be more active. You'll watch what you eat. Because after you've gone through VASA, you, you, you'll ch it will change your life. You won't want to go back to where you were. So it's, it's, it's a start, but you've just got to maintain it, which I have been doing, and the results just get better and better.